guys, it's the RC Genius. Today, I'm showing you how to wrap a Traxxas or any RC battery. Basically, um, we're, I'm going to be showing you how to fix the covering of the battery because you can see here it's breaking apart and that's just what happens when you have older batteries is it separates and when you hose the vehicle off, if you clean it with water, it can make a crack. I mean, it, anything could happen to this, but what I'm going to show you is how to fix that issue. If I can get my camera to focus back on the table. There we go. I'm going to show you how to fix it, and I'm going to rewrap the battery, and it's really easy. And uh, I'm trying to do my best on more and more how-to videos um, and keep the driving videos going as well. But this needs to be done. I have something extremely awesome that's going to be coming up soon. And um, I wanted to make sure that this battery is wrapped and all my batteries are ready to go. Because I've got a huge surprise going on. I'm not going to tell you guys about it yet, but I can guarantee you it will happen before the end of the month. But we're going to focus on rewrapping this battery. And I'm going to do more how-to videos um, and before I start, I would like to mention that I'm not going to be uploading um, this Tuesday, which is 4th of July, actually. I will not be uploading, however, I will be recording on 4th of July, kind of doing like a video of, you know, the fireworks during uh, the evening time, and maybe even doing some cool stuff with fireworks and RC cars combined. I've got some cool ideas that I'm going to be doing, um, but I'm just letting you guys know that my usual schedule of uploading Tuesdays, Thursdays, and sometimes on the weekends... Uh, I'm not going to be uploading on Tuesday this week um, because of the 4th, um, but I will film and possibly even have that up on uh, Wednesday or Thursday, but um, I'm going to try to do two or three videos this weekend to make up for that. So, all you're going to need to wrap a battery is just some electrical tape. Now, lots of people could do this themselves, but if you're new to the hobby, you might be thinking, oh great, now I'm going to have to go and buy a new b battery because now it's not safe or whatever it actually is perfectly fine you just need to rewrap the battery so all you're going to have to do is just take the electrical tape and just wrap the battery in that so just trying to keep it looking as tidy as possible you could also clean the battery I didn't do that um, probably could have but I have not done that so just going around nicely. And if you have a variety of batteries um, in your RC um, shop, I would recommend maybe marking the battery that you're wrapping because you don't you want to make sure that you know which battery is which. Because if you go to try and use a LiPo battery or you need a or you need a nickel metal high drive, oops, sorry. Uh, or you need a nickel metal high drive battery, uh, but you accidentally grab the LiPo one, that's not going to be a good idea. So I would just recommend, if you have that potential issue, just mark the battery with a, um, a marker or something. Because you could also use white electrical tape, any tape, even duct tape could work, but I think that electrical tape is probably better. So, just like that, and then cut the end off with some scissors, just like that, and kind of just go around and flatten it out. It doesn't have to be perfect, but I do kind of like it to look good as well. Gonna just put one more piece on the bottom because this will also help the battery be waterproof now that the plastic, the original plastic covering has been broken. You want to make sure that no water gets in there so that way it doesn't ruin the battery. Everything looks pretty good. That back end could be covered up if you wanted to, but I'm not gonna stress about it. But now the battery is good. You don't have to buy a new one. All you need is some electrical tape that you can find at any hardware store or any uh, store, really, actually, any store you could find. 
uh, electrical tape. So that's an easy tip. I know it's not a long video. Some of you guys have been liking the long videos, but it's definitely um, a good instructional video that people, I'm sure, could find helpful and not stress about having to throw their batteries out. So thank you everyone for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time on the RC Genius.